Hey guys, it's Kim. Welcome back to my channel. Today I wanted to share some ideas that you could incorporate into like a weekend routine or just a chill, relaxing weekend day. I shared one of my Sundays in my last um, video. And so today I wanted to share a bunch of different ideas that you could kind of mix and match to make your own kind of dream weekend, chill, relaxing day. So I feel like there's kind of four components that go into having a great kind of stay at home day. And that would be kind of doing something productive, something very low key productive, doing something fun, obviously, um, having a moment for self care. I love beauty and makeup. So that's definitely something I try to do on the weekend. And then also making sure that the mood and the vibes are good. So let's start with maybe setting up the mood. So the first thing I like to do when I'm having kind of a day at home to myself is make a fun beverage. So for me, this is usually a matcha latte or maybe uh, just a cup of tea or an iced coffee. Sometimes it's like going out to get that, but a lot of times if I'm just having like a stay at home day, it'll be something I make from home. So I think that's number one to have like a good drink or a drink and snack or something to feel like you're having like a luxurious day at home. And other things with mood scents, so like candle or essential oils and if it has like a light, something for like some mood in that arena that smells good and looks nice and makes you feel like you're like having a chill day. And also something that's kind of mood but could go into some other categories is like taking a walk can be really short it can be that walk to pick up an iced matcha latte or a cup of coffee something to kind of get out of the house a little bit <laughs> can be nice on a weekend for self-care i feel like these are probably like really obvious ones but having like a really luxe skincare routine day where you use all those random gadgets that you've accumulated. Uh, I know I have some really like random ones that I tend not to use, but those can be fun to do or something you use more often like a shade roller. One of the weird gadgets I have that I got in a FabFit fun box is like the anti-wrinkle light. So that's fun to do on a self-care day. Doing a face mask, it's just classic self-care day. So other ideas like taking a bath, if that's something you don't usually do. And oh, doing your nails, that's something I like to do on a self-care day, even if it's just like one solid color. For productive things that are like good to do on a weekend where you wanna feel accomplished, but you don't really want to do like work work and you definitely like don't wanna check emails. Planning for the week, I find that that can be kind of like fun and low key. Just kind of looking at your schedule and writing it down, making like to-do lists, something where you like don't have to do something, but you're like preparing can be really good for a relaxing reset day. Cleaning can be really fun to do on a weekend. Am I lying to myself? Maybe, but it's really nice to have like a clean house whenever you're going to have like a reset chill day. So that's something you can do before you start your like relaxing self-care moments is to spruce up the place a little bit. That can be as simple as just like putting things in the dishwasher. I have a robot vacuum that's really easy just to run that and so then you feel like you're productive while also just being really chill. Organizing something, that's something that I like to do on a weekend that feels like it just you can't manage to do it during like a work week but like going through your closet or organizing your bathroom drawer with all those self-care items so that they look all neat and organized is something that's productive but really low stakes that you can do on a Sunday afternoon. And the final category and this is fun and this is definitely something you want to do on a chill weekend and there's a million ideas of things to do for fun. Obviously, I always think of this as like when you play Sims and the people's fun meter goes down, you need to have fun before you can do anything productive and for the rest of your week. So try to have fun on the weekend. For me on a chill weekend, that usually involves like maybe like building a puzzle or binge watching a Netflix true crime series, reading a book. Also like playing a video game all day. I'm playing uh, Paper Mario right now and it's super fun. I need to check on my Animal Crossing. I've been neglecting it with Paper Mario. But yeah, those are some of my like fun things I like to do for a few hours. 
if not more, on the weekend to kind of feel relaxed and take my mind off of things. And bonus points if you are playing your video game while wearing your face mask with your candle going and a nice matcha, then you've like hit the weekend perfecta of things to do. So anyway, those are a few of my ideas that I kind of like to do on the weekend to reset. Let me know down below what your like self-care, relaxing, chill weekend ideas are down below so I can add those into my routine and we can give each other some ideas. Thanks so much for watching and I'll see you next time. Bye.